It is the end of watch for a Huntsville firefighter. His family and friends gathered today for Brian Sexton's last call. Brian lost his life January 4th. It was a tragic accident on his day job, not related to his firefighting duties. He was only 30 years old. WATE 6 on your side's Kirsty Crawford was there today as family celebrated his life and honored his memory. Brian Sexton's life was all about family. He was a hard worker just to take care of his family. He loved his family a lot. He always wanted to do family stuff. He adored his wife and four young children. His mom will always remember the first time her son became a father. He was so tickled. He was so happy. He loved his girls a lot, but when he knew that he was having a boy, he was tickled to death. Brian Sexton also loved his fire department family. He started with Huntsville Fire when he was just 15 years old. You know, half of his life he spent with Huntsville, started as a junior firefighter and then kind of moved up. So it's, it's been emotional for all of us. While on duty, he was known as Bubbles. Brian was always positive, making people laugh. He loved volunteering, and his family knew the risk of him fighting fires. But they were shocked that he actually died after something went wrong at his day job. December the 3rd, actually. He was at work in uh, the, one of the asphalt silos. From our understanding, exploded. And he was burnt. Brian was in the hospital for a month before passing away. Although he didn't die while fighting fires, his Huntsville department family made sure that's how he would be honored. His number at the fire department, we're gonna, I'm gonna permanently, nobody's ever gonna wear that number again in his, you know, in his memorial. We've got um, stickers being made for our trucks that are gonna put in memory of Brian. While he's no longer here on earth with his family, he will always be with his fire department and kids, keeping them safe in a different way. Daddy's an angel now, isn't he? Daddy's watching over you, isn't he, baby? Kirsty Crawford, WATE 6, on your side. Oh, Brian Sexton was given the full honor guard service. His wife will receive his firefighter's nameplate and his mother the folded American flag. He was laid to rest at Rector Bird Cemetery in Huntsville.